So I said I was going to probably be done enough of the last part, so my battery's almost dead, but I'm going to try and see how long I can go before the battery decides to die on the cam camera here. But hey, I am the dude, Jester Dudorama, and I am here to be a dude and go through a spooky house because it's, once again, Spooky's House of Jump Scares. Free on Steam, dudes. So let's play. 359. <laughs> Any new subjects to go against? I don't know. But I'll find out. As I have 40 more rooms to run through. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah. Let's go. Ha <laughs> ha. Bueno. Ha. Ah, it's a bridge. Ha <laughs> ha. Math. Oh, another research room. Anything new? Um, nope. Uh, nope. Modify house layout? Still can't do it. Dang it. So much spoop, so little time. Chairs? It's like a church room. Oh, yeah. That sounded spooky. I like spooky, except when she's a jerk. I don't like jerks. I don't like being jerked around. Unless it's for jerky. Then again, that's the only thing that should be jerked. Just jerky. So yeah. Let's go. Travel. Running. <laughs> so, as I run, 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 to the right, I rave, 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 because it's all good in the hood. Oh, look at that hole in the ceiling. Do I have to fight the zombie again? g g g g, -g zombie Woo-ho-ho-ho! -ho -ho. Hello, Spidey. You made me jump. So, we do the thing? We do the thing. Oh, oh, hello, skeleton. I finally get to see you. How you doing? Oh, another hole in the ceiling. Let's go left, shall we? Yes. I ask you a lot of questions asking, shall we? But it's only because I invite you to join my realm of pure insanity. <laughs> oh, no. It's Spidey! Dang it, Spidey! Oh, well, no. Clickety-clacker, that was it. Clickety-clacky! What you doing? Are you trying to chase me? Because that's a little rude. You are not worthy of the booty. The Jesse booty. And only someone else can get the Jesse booty. And that is the Jitty booty. The Jitty booty, who is quite busy right now. Ha-ha! <laughs> Clickety-clacker, you... <laughs> Sorry, Clickety-clacker, I screwed up your name. You can't follow me into the arcade room. My jitty booty just belched. <laughs> As he giggles maniacally. My voice cracked. Shush, I've been recording a few episodes. Whoops, wrong way. Oh, bones. More bones. Does that mean more death is ahead? I would surely think so. Because I have ten more rooms to go. Hanged man! Ho oh, oh. ho! I meet you again, and again, and again. This room itself is like a maze. Is this murder by death? I don't know, but I shall learn. Huh. Any new specimens? Let's find out. Okay. Okay. Let's see if I got anything other. This specimen 11. We don't. Haha. <laughs> Too bad. Oh well. Back. And let's get out of here. Exit the program. <laughs> I feel like a programmer when I'm in cat DOS. <laughs> the cat discovering system. I don't know what cat stands for. Creepy um Creepy Awareness Technology. Creepy Awareness Technology. I guess I can go with that. Creepy Awareness Technology Disc Operating System. Creepy Awareness Tech! That sounds cooler. Haha, <laughs> Cat DOS, the best operating system. Oh, you did die. Did you like the wine? You have a nice hat. Oh, there's your quill. So sad. Hang in there, right. Oh, you didn't leave a note? Oh, well. Well, let's see if I can get a little bit farther before my battery dies. I feel like it's freaking out last night, I have to say that. Spooky saving.
with the thunder of a good time. So, oh, that was spooky. Do 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 <laughs> that's the only thing that's there because apparently you did want to be drawn like a romantic French skeleton. Should I call you Rose Hat? Or should I call you Rosie? I'm guessing Rose can apply as a last name, so I guess it makes it gender neutral. I don't know. So, Rose, I am so sorry, but one day you and your quill shall. Oh, whoops. I'll have to kind of do something about that later. I forgot to send out a Skype. Hi, Mara, you're in my video. Yeah, Skype um, usually has the habit of showing on video game screens because it's a butt like that. Larger bricks. These are like Mario edition bricks. So, am I going to get any other spooky cardboard out cutouts? Oh, dang it, I knew I should have looked at the freaking specimen database to uh, see if that spook face changed. Let me scoot in my chair as I get more comfortable. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yeah, not this time. Nope, not doing that again. I don't need Clayface. Woo! Stumpy! Dang it, Stumpy. Well, I can play brother like that. Cold bricks. Light bricks, actually. I see a wall. Locked. Wait. Where's the enemy? I don't know. Let's see if I can find a safe place. Scully! Spooky, scary skeletons return at every corner. I don't really care for them, they're really kind of creepy. But not really, they're spooky. Um. Threshold of consciousness. If you say so, but I guess this might be a good area to kind of end things on. Well, hello there. Are you lost, little one? This place can help those who are ready, but expect turmoil more than you are used to. Okay, if you say so. She's a cute kitty. This place can help those who are ready, but expect turmoil more than you are used to. Hmm. This is very interesting, and I really want to see more. Well, Kitty, what do you think? Well, you know, my battery's about dead, but I shall check out a single room. Oh, dear. This was that anatomy moving in walls. Two sides of the same coin. Knowing your projections can help you achieve freedom. Two sides of the same coin. Huh. Knowing your projections can help you achieve freedom. If you say so. How do I do here? I like this guide cat. She's cute but cool. Yeah, they're moving anatomy and now I see what they mean. I'd rather not die there. So, one more room. The mask you wear serves its purpose well, but be careful not to lose yourself in it. That is actually very profound and wise, because I can agree with the um, concept of wearing masks. I wear, I have worn mine pretty often. That always a fan. Put on your mask. Be part of something. Be a, who a part of something. This is why you don't really like working in a lot of workplaces like customer service because that is a mask I hate wearing and stresses me out to no end. So my best advisement to you is that you can wear a mask to kind of help yourself through work and everything else, but don't fall behind the mask too deep that you find yourself thinking that mask is you because 
You should be yourself in the end. That's all I'm going to recommend. Just be yourself and don't fall too deep into a mask. Because getting out of that mask can take a lot of time and a lot of pain. So I'm trying to keep eyeing my battery and my camera because I want to give you guys my face of love. So that's something else that's nice and bloody. But that'll be for the next episode as soon as I check this last room out. Oh my. Spacey and disifying. What do you have to say? Balance is key to keeping your mind free and sane. I really like this cat. She is very wise in this factor. Because I can just feel myself losing balance looking at these walls. The guys and girls, or single person who made this game, I really like your game. I highly recommend this game so far because it seems to get better as it goes on. It doesn't get stale. It seems to keep getting more and more interesting, and that's how you should make a game. Keep it going into how it is, but keep it fun. Keep it changing. I mean, unlike Five Nights at Freddy's, you kind of get to expect what's going on, and then you have to deal with the animatronics who decide to pop out when you expect them. But here... Other than Fungi, of course, you kind of know he's a good guy. Maybe, maybe not. But yeah, this is actually very wise as a game. So, as I sit here with Kitty and Clock, Clock Kitty, I can't almost say Clocky because I have a friend named, nicknamed Clocky, but I think it's time to say thank you for watching on Spooky's House of Horrors. As Clock Kitty and I have to bid you adieu this time. And say thank you for watching very much. I am Jesto de Rama. This is all I have for tonight. But thank you as always. And as always, my outro is good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Oh my goodness! Okay, this is getting bad. This is getting worse. Oh, no you don't. I'm gonna let myself heal. You have to wait. Sorry guys, I'm gonna be healing for a moment. Because this Puppet Master is getting a little bit angry at me. What's the matter? Are you mad that I can actually find your secrets? Because you are just a puppet that likes to move when I look away.